Hi Gemini, welcome to May 2018. This is your general reading, so we're going to go over a general theme. What's up with your money, your career, how other people are going to either improve your life and then also how they could potentially ruin it, um, you know, in the month of May. Not forever, just the month of May. <laughs> and then what are we supposed to be focusing on spiritually in order to have the happiest month possible? And then what is your crystal of the month, your power crystal if you're into that? So let's get started. I keep forgetting to mention this, but for those of you who um, don't know, if you go to my website, and there's like a link in the description box below, you can sign up to win a free reading every month. And so like you just sign up once and you're automatically in the drawing forever style. And so I just wanted to let you know. Okay, Gemini, Sun, Moons, and Risings. Okay, this is what we got to keep in mind. This is our theme. You get to create your own reality. You are what you think. What you think about, you bring about. That's the law of attraction, Habibis. Okay, so we're all vibrating at different levels, right? When we're vibrating at a low area or a low vibration, we're attracting negative shit to us. Lower vibrational people, lower vibrational energies. When we're up here at love or above, we are attracting all of this awesome stuff in our life. That's how master manifestors work. You notice that they're happy and you think it's because they got all the shit that they were manifesting. No, they were happy first and they started getting their shit. Make sense? Okay, so here's the thing. We don't get to control our thoughts, right? We don't get to decide what we think, but we get to decide the thoughts that we believe. Does that make sense? So you're working on something, you're like, oh, I'm so stupid. You get to decide if you want to believe that and lower your own vibration or go, wait, that's not true. I'm actually super brilliant. I'm just learning in this specific area, if that makes sense, okay? So, what is going on in regards to your money in the month of May? Okay, so... You finally found some balance and now you're moving forward. And a lot of you have kind of spoken about your goals and that's what's helping you to bring those about now. Oh, I'm so like, spoiler alert, maybe your crystal of the month is blue. Because <laughs> this is all about communication. So your money, your communication about money is super important this month and um, that's just so fun. Nothing's an accident. Um, so everything should be clear to you. There are no deception. Um, there's no lies. Nobody's trying to steal from you or anything like that. Generally in money, things are safe. They might not have always felt that way, but you're kind of coming into this like smoother, better mindset about it and therefore you should have more of it or things should just be more balanced. What's going on in general for a career in the month of May? And they're saying um, you'll be working a lot on your own and probably spending some a good amount of time studying or like researching specific things related to your career. But these are things that are interesting to you and they'll help you to achieve your wishes. Nine is all about career actually. And so this is a really awesome month if you wanted to take a class, like um, go to a retreat, start school again, um, anything like that. Watch a webinar. This is a fantastic month for you. I'm actually getting goosebumps because that's really, really important for somebody who's watching this, okay? That is like a make it or break it. And if you do it, you will be so pleased with yourself later down the road when it starts to pay off for you, okay? Um, how are other people going to improve your month? And they say, you know what? Other people, um, well, their own, their problems help you to reflect on your own shit and go, actually, I'm doing pretty well, by contrast. And I know that sounds shitty or mean, but it isn't, right? It's just going to hire your own vibration by going, okay, you know what? Actually, yeah, I am creating my own reality. And I see that these bad things are always happening to this negative person. That's not my story. That's not me. You get to decide. The mental conflicts that other people are having, you're like, okay, I'm going to express some gratitude that I don't have that problem, right? <laughs> Um, how are people going to sort of try to come and ruin your month? And what they're saying is um, people just think that they know more than you, that they're more tuned in or whatever. 
But you're going to feel that coming because they're wrong. They're not. Anybody who's going to try to interfere with your month and ruin your sunshine, take it away, is not going to be able to because you're going to sense that from a mile away before they even arrive. So what's the advice on handling that? And they're like, you know what? Like I said, just that gratitude, that heart chakra opening, you know, creating our own reality, living in the positive and pretty much this is just like celebrating the success of all of these things that are happening as a result of it. So looking at this, it's a um, three. And three is a very spiritual number. It's the number of the ascended masters like Jesus, the prophet Muhammad, Moses, um, Archangel Michael or whatever. So um, that just means that spirit is very closely guiding you right now. And the more that you express gratitude and you like rejoice for the things that are going well, the more blessings that will be bestowed upon you in the month of May. So this is really fantastic. Um, what do you need to focus on, like from a spiritual aspect, in order to have the happiest May ever? And they're like, the law of attraction. Exactly what we were talking about. There are no accidents, right? Nothing is coincidence. You get to create your own reality. For, for many of you that follow this guidance, you are going to have the most amazing May ever. Whatever it is you're trying to attract, you get those feelings of like joy and happiness and like trust in the universe that those things are coming. You will receive them in the month of May. For those of you who are like, oh, it's bullshit. Um, well, okay. You might have a bullshit month. Good for you. <laughs> so your power crystal, it's aqua aura. Isn't it beautiful? Um, anyway, I don't know if that'll show up in the video, but there's like a little angel orb right there. Uh, so this helps you to get really good at communication. Like it'll help you to discuss any emotional issues with others. It cleanses your room. It cleanses the aura. It brings harmony and interact um, into your interactions and you know like your communications with others. It'll be very encouraging to help you to you fully utilize like your own talents and skills. It helps you develop um, your third eye and your clairvoyance as well as your clairaudience. It helps you with concentration and focus as well as clarity. And so um, if you have trouble with the law of attraction, that'll be actually super helpful because it'll help you to go, wait, stop. I just was saying, I don't want this. Let me pause, redirect and think, what do I want? right? So um, this is going to be very, very helpful for you in that way. If you're interested in learning more about it, there is a link in the description box below and love and light. See you soon for love readings. Thanks so much for watching this video and getting all the way to the end of it. I really appreciate your support. If you are interested in other videos, click here. If you are interested in subscribing, go ahead and click here. Hit that notification bell so that you get alerted to when new videos come out and also when I do surprise live streams. And then if you're interested in winning a free 20-minute video uh, reading personally every month, go ahead and click right here. Mwah!